All right, so if you want to copy and paste, um, in Premiere Pro, it's quite interesting. Uh, when I started learning uh, Adobe Premiere Pro, um, I had a hard time, uh, difficult situation to find where it is. But you can actually, in fact, go here and click on uh, Copy. But before doing that, we have to grab our videos. So I'm just gonna grab our videos. Um, and move all the videos in different tracks but um, now let's say I would like to take this subscribe and move it above this video but actually I want two for two videos so in this case uh, you can right click on this video or just select this video and then go to copy you can also select the video and go to edit and then click on copy or control plus C and then to paste it uh, you can paste it right so I can control plus C copy and then um, I can move the cursor where I want and uh, I can paste this video now I press 3 to enable click on here and now will paste this video right above this video as you can see so I have the video right here over here now another way um, the another way I learned which is quite interesting is that I'm actually using I'm, I'm selecting that video that I want to copy then hold alt and just this this drag after that and this will this will create a copy of that video or or image and uh, <clears throat> you can also enable if you're working enable this target uh, tracks which means now if I'm uh, let's say I'm only working with this track and when I copy one this video will be copied it will be pasted right over here where I need which is quite helpful right and I can move this here now I'm just gonna go here right key and grab color key move it over this video you can also right click and set uh, scale to frame size and now here I'll just select this green increase threshold and now we just remove the green screen I can double click now and move where I want and you can also go here in uh, in edit and then keyboard shortcuts and here you can see your shortcuts for paste control plus v copy save for make a copy so here you can see all the shortcuts copy control plus c you can change your copy to any any shortcut you want and this is very helpful for you know just changing the shortcuts you can also use control alt k to enter keyboard shortcuts and here you can change a custom one you also have some presets here that's great for Final Cut Pro and this is great if you are a Mac user and uh, for if you want to just grab a video from your project manager you can just grab and drag and drop first initially I thought uh, I can control C and control V but that doesn't work only if I drag and drop the video or the image it also shows here copy but and then I can of course go here um, and the option is not there like you can right click copy but then yeah now you have the option but paste which will paste the video inside the project manager if you can find this one is the panel is closed 
you can find your project manager right over here so if you can't find it um you can't find it no worries you can also reset your usually it's here in project and you select your project um, youtube project i have but you can also go here in workspace and then reset to saved layout and uh yeah this will just copy and paste inside your project manager will make a copy of your video inside the project manager not here but anyway here just drag and drop and now you can copy and paste Control c Control v and you can copy now we'll paste this inside here you also have the option to select follow playhead you know if you enable that now we'll paste the video exact where your playhead uh, playhead is so just change the playhead one click or just drag or just one click and then control plus c control plus v to paste or right uh, you can right click here and click on copy you can also copy paste attributes you can unlink if you do if you only want to copy the uh, video but not the audio so that's really important to know because if i just drag and it drags the video audio as well only want the video so i just have to click on here on to unlink and now uh, they're unlinked <clears throat> so now you can also go in effects and here i can add a little more key and here or here you can enable color and click on auto this will just give you better results for your video you can also white balance and select maybe dark this is a great option as well all right you also have some inputs here but that's the end of this video i really hope you found this video helpful thank you so much for watching and if you have any questions related to adobe premiere let me know in the comment section i'll create a tutorial for you thank you for watching and take care